All right, Ed Pivos from M Live, and I'm with one of my favorite actresses. I gotta call you one of my favorite actresses, Thank uh, you. Amanda Burst. That is how you pronounce it. That is how you pronounce it. There you go. Married with Children, Fright Night. All right, we're gonna get to Married with Children in just a second because obviously we're gonna talk about that. Um, but Fright Night is a very good horror movie if you haven't seen it. And this is one of your uh, early big movie roles. Absolutely. I'd actually done only one other feature film. I appeared in a feature film, but it was just sort of a, um, just a, a blip on the screen. And then I had done a movie with Stephen Jeffries right before Fright Night. So when that movie ended, we were like, well, what are you up to next? Oh, I'm doing this little horror movie. Oh, so am I. So we had no idea that, that we were each in Fright Night and would see each other right away. And, um, and yeah, and primarily my acting career was in television. And, and then that ended when I started my directing career. So it's pretty cool to be at these cons where the two things I'm most known for as an actor turned into be these cult, classic, wonderful things that I get to talk to people about my my first career. So There you go. And like I was telling you earlier, I really do watch Fright Night once a year. It's kind of an 80s, well, it is an 80s throwback. It's from 1985. It's kind of like, it's a little bit of comedy. It's a little bit of, of horror. Now, you're a comedy actress and you've done horror. Is there, do you have a preference, uh, you know, of, of what genre you like to do? Well, I ended up in comedy. Um, you know, I studied theater, and I, I, I did a lot of dramatic roles. And the wonderful thing about the character of Amy in Fright Night is she has this great arc that she goes through. She's this innocent, and then she transforms, and then it gets horrific. But as in any acting role, you always begin and end with a truthful part of yourself that you know you're trying to to live under imaginary circumstances with so um mary with children became very broad as the years rolled on i mean we became the the simpsons live action you know but um but it was great fun and my career stayed you know behind the camera in comedy so that's really that's the world i ended up in and uh works for me now, I think a lot of people probably ask you this, what the heck, might as well. Will there be an official Married with Children reunion maybe someday in the future with the whole cast in any shape or form, maybe like a episode or on another TV show or maybe on YouTube? I don't know. The possibilities are there. I, don't know. Uh, I wouldn't hold my breath on that one. There was talk of a reboot with David Faustino, and I'm keeping my finger that. I'm keeping my fingers crossed for him for that. I think it's a great idea, and I would love to see that happen for him. But as far as getting a reunion with the whole cast, I seriously doubt it. Well, that's okay because we have plenty of episodes to watch on DVD and in syndication. It's always on. It's fantastic. Do you still keep in touch with a lot of the cast on occasion? I'm in touch with Christina and David Garrison. I don't. I left Los Angeles years and years ago. David lives in New York. I just saw him this year when I was there directing, a, staging a, a play reading. And Christina and I are Facebook friends, and I, I keep track of her life. And actually saw her this year as well when I was down in L.A. Yeah. All right. And last question. I'm just kind of curious because you went by, and Married Children. I just love that show. So groundbreaking. Do you go by, or do people call you Marcy Rhodes more, Marcy Darcy more? Or Amanda? I mean, what What if more people, when they see you, go, hey, Marcy Darcy, hey, Marcy Ro um, it, Rhodes? Rhodes is days gone by, <laughs> you know. So if anything, they like the rhyme, so they do yeah. the Marcy Darcy thing. Um, uh, yeah, I, I still respond if somebody calls out, hey, Marcy, yeah. you know, I... I I, I know from whence I came, and uh, and yeah, I get Amanda too, and it's just it's just again really delightful. I've been a director for 25 yeah. years, so it's that show gave me my directing career, and uh, so it's really nice for people to remember that I was in front of the camera once upon a time. So. And you did a lot of sitcoms, uh, other than Mary, directed a lot of sitcoms mm -hmm. uh, behind the scenes that a lot of people are very familiar with. So check that out on IMDb. You'll be surprised with a lot of the great shows that she's directed over the years. So all right, Amanda. Amanda Burse, yes. come out and see her at Motor City please, Nightmares please. fantastic event. So I'd love to see um, Ed Pivos for M Live. Well, thank you oh, so much. Oh, I appreciate it.